When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny. I got this weird feeling in my knee like it needs to pop, but it won't pop. You know what I'm saying? Like it's just like right there and I need to like crack that hole somehow. It's right there. It feel crooked as hell. And I can't crack this hole. Somebody Google how to crack a knee. But we at uh, Vasa Fitness right now in Thornton. Thornton, this gym is this is probably where I'm gonna be coming on the real. Cause this gym, you got a blurry power lifting, like squat, Olympic lifting area. And then you got your weights and all that. And they got plenty of stuff out here. They got a whole turf area that y'all saw I was at, doing you know, warm ups. And they got a whole another turf area outside. So I could definitely get in some spreads, some jumps, some athletic shit, combination of stuff here. Uh, basketball court, bro, so, you know. No problem filming, they saw the camera and everything. It was whatever. So uh, it's pretty much the same distance as my other gym, which is more of a bodybuilder gym. But uh, yeah, this is uh, probably where I'll be getting it up for sure. at 315 right now it's kind of weird warming up for deadlifts you know because it's like you never know how many how much really reps you should do in between each tier that you're aiming for and uh i had a funny conversation on instagram where somebody was like uh, deadlifts are probably the most they say deadlifts are probably the most ego lift of all the least so i said they are the least beneficial out of all the compound lifts squat bench shoulder press and i 120 to 2000 million percent disagree i feel like deadlift is the most optimal lift if i was to choose from all the lifts and say i can only do one compound lift for the rest of my life i would choose deadlift because you're building full body strength. Not only can you continually build, you know, your legs from it, but you can continue to build your back, your shoulder strength, your, your bicep strength. You know, you fully build the body from doing this one lift. And this is the one lift that I would choose out of all of them. For me, I think that bench press is the most least beneficial ego lifting exercise. 100% and I love to bitch because it's easy I literally get to lay down I get to lay down and just push weight you know what I'm saying it's the easiest lift period but bench press is a staple in everybody's like fitness journey you know it's not you the matter of fact I just got asked right now 
how much do you deadlift? I think that is the first time I've been asked how much can you deadlift versus, and that's even before I started like like practicing or warming up deadlift. And um, and out of all the times, it's mainly how much you bench. That's like the guy code, first thing to ask if you don't know somebody. Hey bro, how much you bench? No, these people, they're wrestlers. And they ask me how much do I deadlift? And once again, for a wrestler, deadlift would be more defend, more beneficial than benching. For a gym bro, only just like gym bros that aren't athletes and stuff, it's always bench press. So, but the real ones ask how much you squat. So, so this will be six, this is 585. This will be 675 right here. Uh, going up by these 45s is a lot. But if I get this one, I'll probably replace this plate and throw on the red plate. And I think I should be right at um, right at 700. I'm tired of my body. Absolutely. My right knee and my left shoulder. And I just seem to just can't get healthy right now. So everything's not, everything's not nagging me. It's really annoying right now. Because I should easily be hitting 700. I should be hitting 700 right now. And I'm not. I might try for it again. I, I felt that I might try for it one more time. All right, so it's punishment for not hitting 705, 700. I need to row a thousand meters within six minutes. That is the goal. It should be five. But uh, cause usually I get five, five hundred meters in two minutes. Um, but we'll, we'll see. We'll, we'll aim for five minutes.
teach them. Y'all know what I'm like, I'm, I mean, like, I, I'm barely, I'm limping right now because it's like, it, it needs to shift over. I don't know why. It, I'll end up fucking it up even more, but I don't know what it is, but it needs to shift over. It's been, it's bothering me so much right now. Like I'm like, like I want to go play basketball, but I, I can't do that right now. Cause the moment I jump, I feel like if I land, I'm done. I'm absolutely done. So I'll stop. It feels like my knee is like too, to the right. I can barely walk out. Yo, what the? Probably need to do some like exercises or something. Get a, get a resistance band and try to pop it back into place by pushing it back. But that's the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Did a little, you know, back after um, the deadlifts. Did some rows. Um, always do some type of endurance, something every day, you know, uh, for time, um, distance for time, whatever within a time limit. So we, I got to a thousand meters within four minutes and well below five minutes. Uh, so I got to a thousand meters in like four minutes, I think like seven seconds, something like that. So I'm uh, pretty okay with that, um, especially doing, dealing with the, the deadlifts and stuff. So strength and endurance, one that strength and conditioning training, all break long, you already know what it is. Uh, another note, no more vlogs on this channel. I will either have a separate channel for vlogs or I'm just gonna film just whatever because sometimes I just wanna film, you know, cool stuff or whatever and not have to, you know, worry about people be like, hey, it's Ron, I came to this channel for fitness stuff. So this is just gonna be straight fitness, rugby, sports content channel. No more vlogs. You know, I might have like a mini vlog, you know, dealing with, you know, the workout, kind of like back in New York where it was like a small time thing, like day of eating type of stuff. But other than that, um, all vlogs will be on another channel, either the couples channel, um, like I got rid of all of the Euro videos and stuff, so all of that's gonna be on the couples channel. And on top of that, um, we are going to be possibly starting a new channel, just like, just like honestly, I just wanna start a new channel where I just talk about shit, you know what I'm saying? I saw Austin did that too, it could be relationship advice, just stuff like that, you know, anything outside of fitness. And, um, or I might just add it onto my gaming channel, you know, just kind of like whatever, but yeah. Like and subscribe. Peace out. When I was a little boy, I wanted to be a hero. The truth is, when you get older, sometimes things don't always turn out the way you hoped they would. So you gotta do what you gotta do. Handle that business. Believe in yourself. Create your own destiny.